part of the reason why you guys have 24 seasons now under your belt is because you do show the ups, you do show the, the downs, you show families that, hey, we're on camera and you know, it's not all happy all the time. Everyone's met Josiah, but we don't have plans for Karen to meet Josiah. Like they still think they did nothing wrong. Zach and Tori have really isolated themselves, you know, from me and Cha-Cha. Like, we are a normal family. We fight like a family. We love like a family. But at the end of the day, we are a family. And heading into this new season, what would you say, how would you describe, and I know it might be a complex question, how would you describe the status of the relationship of the Roloff family right now? I, I would say it, the status of the relationship I've had is summarized. It's, it's going. It's on the right path. It's on the working. We've had some setbacks, uh, you know, in recent years. We shared all those on the, on the upcoming season and and before. Um, but you know, it's it's all, our real life is always a little bit ahead of when things are released. So we are, you know, we're definitely working. I'm talking to Zach every day. We're planning my dad's memorial, so the whole family is really involved in that um, on a you know very active basis. It's not easy, but it's going in the right direction, I would say. And I we you know don't have big expectations. I, every single person I ever talk to. I'm always curious, does your family have stuff going on? And lo and behold, everyone does. Karen tells other people that she's waiting for our olive branch, and that olive branch, the dove took it to another island, I don't know. Well, here we are, season 24 of the show. When you hear that, 24 seasons, could you ever have imagined having cameras around this long? No, no, we could never, we would have never imagined, we did not imagine it, it just sort of snuck up on us, you know, it's amazing how time flies. Yeah, I mean, with that being said too, I, I, how long do you want to keep the cameras around? When will you know it's time to literally shut them off? Yeah, well, we, get, we take that kind of, kind of day by day, day, by day. <laughs> or week by week, or, you know, month by month, so we just sort of take that one <laughs> step at a time, but uh you know, every uh, every year we kind of reevaluate where we're at, and if we have more more, you know, positive uh, things to share, and that we just kind of take it as it goes. Yeah. Well, speaking of positive things to share, of course we have another season. You know, it, it's always kind of a, interesting when the season gets ready to come out. You know, in one minute we're excited and we can't wait to see how they put everything together, and the next minute you're scared to death, you're hiding under the bed. You know. <laughs> hoping that, you know, you didn't make a fool of yourself on TV. But, you know, we're sharing our true family story, the up, the down. And just about, you know, to kind of relate to your last question, just about the time we think, oh man, we can't do this anymore, it's too embarrassing, it's too, it's too hard. Um, then somebody comes up to us, you know, in the public and will say, you know, how touched they are and how their family's going through some of the same stuff, you know, the same hard stuff that's really hard. So it makes it a little harder to share your hard stuff, you know, in the public eye, and you get a lot of comments about that. But you know, we've learned uh, for the many years that we've been doing it um, that the the in the balance, it's be, you know, it's good. It's really showing people that we're just a normal family. We have certain challenges, and uh, but we're going, we're working through the ups and downs, you know, and hope other families are doing the same. What can we expect, especially in terms of drama? Because I know there's a lot of tension. Well, you know, our show has always kind of been a relationship-based show, so it shows the different relationships and how they interact. And we spend a lot of time with Chris and Amy, um, you know, continuing to develop our our relationship with them. Um, and uh, we Lila's birthday, you know, there's birthdays involved, and that we're all there. And, uh, what else can we remember? I I don't know. We film it, and then we forget. Yeah, and there's you know, of course, there's always the drama piece, and they. You know, we'll, we'll have the family getting along, not getting along, the house going up for sale. We're hopeful that another season doesn't go by where there's still strife, but we're just kind of waiting. It is tough too, because like hearing you guys try to figure out, okay, when was this filmed? What was the state of our relationship then? Where we are now, it's two different things. And then you're Absolutely. reliving it when the episodes air, oh, yeah. which is tough. Cause like when I was watching, but I was like, hmm, I wonder if the relationship is still like this with the tension and it's not things have changed it's as you said you, you yeah. talk to zach you know daily now and so is that hard for you to relive the episodes as they air and then see these conversations kind of come back with new life on social media all that or do you tune it out do you not 
it's a, it's a combination of both. We, we, it is hard to re relive them. It, it aggravates the situation sometimes again. But, uh, but, and then, you know, but then we do tune it out. A lot of times we don't, we watch a preview and then we kind of tune it out, you know. So um, it's sort of a count. You more tune in things out than uh, anything. <laughs> stay off social media, stay off the thing, you know, and just know that the more there's buzz and talking about and people are, you know, slamming me or slamming somebody or Karen, you know, it's, uh, it's, well, people are interested. You know, my dad used to say something very wise to me. He said, would say when I would come home crying from school and say, Dad, at school, the kids tease me because I was short. He goes, well, Matt, at least they're paying attention to you. There's a lot of lonely people out there that have to wear, dye their hair purple and put on bright pink tennis shoes to get attention from people. And so at least you're getting attention. May not be right, but let's figure out how to take that attention and make it positive. And so that's been a mantra in my life, you know, that, you know, we're not lonely. You know, Karen and I are together. We have a wonderful family. We love all of our kids dearly. Oh, yeah, there you go. Okay, so now I'll do this. Okay. This needs to be a little bigger so you can actually drink coffee out of it. Okay. Wasn't there a movie about this? <laughs> <laughs> Will we see more of your guys' relationship evolve in the new season? Oh. I don't know. What do you think? <laughs> <laughs> we couldn't tell you. <laughs> now, Karen and I are still very, very close. We love our Arizona place. We travel down there to help my mother and her folks are down there. And we just got back late last night from a little quick little getaway. Um, and we have some exciting vacations planned together. But as far as um, anything else, you just have to wait and see. Okay, so can I ask, like, do you two talk about the next step in your relationship? We, All the time. Okay. <laughs> do you guys talk about where you see yourselves um, down the road, long term? I'm going to say the M word. Do you talk about marriage? Yeah. We do. We do. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and we um, we have a plan that when all the stars align just right, we will both know it. So we're trying not to feel pressured, mm -hmm. but we're totally committed to each other. And we do we we talk about our one year plan, our two year plan, our five year plan. So you're start, starting to sound like our executive producer. <laughs> I know. I was gonna say when you said it, we're like we're trying not to be pressured. I'm like, so ladies, stop asking <laughs> us these questions. No, I, I you two have built such a, a beautiful relationship, and I'm so happy that you found each other. And, Me too. and thank you. Ah! God, love is the best. It is the best. It's when you find your best friend, like everything yeah. changes. And, and that's it's just, exactly right. It's so fun to go through life, the highs, the lows, to have a partner, to have a teammate. And you guys are very blessed to have found each other and be able to do life. This is one of a kind right here. Yes. I, I landed him. He's very, very amazing.